This is Bus 4 tour where you can see Bus 4's some important landmarks, interesting buildings from the water. Misafirlerimiz teklerimize hoş geldiniz. Sorunu tartışmış olacağız. Görmenizi istediğimiz önemli noktalar, kurasıyla kalkışıyla beraber, sorumuzu tarihi Galata Kulesi, Kuruzya Limanı, Valide Sultan Cami, Roma Bahçesi Ağır Kulesi, İstanbul'un Dinler Çevresi'yle Sultan Ahmet Cami, Topkapı Sarayı, Ayasofya, Haliç, ardından Müstesna Hedefi'yle,
Süleymaniye'nin hafızalardaki süreç görünümü bile turumuzu tamamlayarak başladığımız noktaya geri döneceğiz. Teknelerimizde sigara içim ödüğünü duyuyor, iyi vakit geçirmemizi temenni ederiz. Müzik suyu anılar, adı sahi, edovarı sağlık. Dört yıl sayesinde... 17. yüzyılın ilk yarısında Osmanlı Padişahı, dördüncü yüzyılları, ülkemizde gelen yabancı yolcu gelinlerini yanaştığı limanı. Thank you. 
and the whole popular with its wildlife and certain strawberries along with its diverse fruits and vegetables. Shiraan Palace is one of most precious places that is still in order from Shire Palace. In some of the villages, Castellan brothers who were architects of Seraglio to build the palace in 1874. It served as parliamentary building until it burned out the flood in 1910. For the community of the limit, Shiraan Palace offered many parties, meeting their birthdays, and such with its yard, and a stolen process illuminated with standards, firewalls, and chandeliers. It is true that the original foundation of Shiraan is a small one, as I'm showing you here. The rest of the country is the same as the first one of the Sultan of Antilogy. The European of Baroque and Baroque, as we see today, is the first one of the first one of the year. После смерти султана Абдулази за 1986 году дворец получил пенсию и знания за султаном Рота Театра в течение всех 28 лет, который был сделан в Москве Байтар. Впоследствии, в 1909 году, сюда получил султан Арланом Османской империи. Однако пожар в 1910 году разрушил здание с панемрамами и каменной части, которые выделили сейчас. Он долго оставался в руинах, в конце десятилетия группа Чинчинский провела масштабную реставрацию и приготовила жизнь. Он доказан же изделен из Чинди Аришинда, но и критическая зона Кунишала, что основные хорошие замены для Чинчинского старинного и анализа на стране Ринкалдо Сурья Сарайдори, и на месте Каласа Сарайни на Ашкетсу, и когда ты осуществил на общественной стране Сурья. Сурья Сарайни на Ашкетсу, он протокол Сурья Сурья. Портатер означает средний деревья, это обозначает середину бактер. Портатер очень популярен в единице на жители и дешевле, свои обычные литры, кафе, бары. Но самое главное, это одна из самых знаменитых ступенек в нем стиле. Тоже архитектура ценилась от большого горячего бактера. Два больших окон в этой церемонии. Это ничего не поражает свою высоту и объем, как и считается элегантностью и местоположением. Эта кошка была выпуклана
what you are watching here is the trip of Bosphorus. I hope you already figured out that this is 360 degrees video. If you're watching this in uh, virtual reality glasses, then you can turn your head around to see different sides, the different views. If you are looking at this uh, via your phone, your smartphone, then you can either move your smartphone around, turn it around, or you can uh, drag the video with your finger so you, you can watch different sides. And if you're watching this on the TV screen or on the monitor of your or your, or your laptop, then you can navigate with the mouse or with the keyboard with the control errors well the, with with the buttons a w d you can turn uh, you can move your view around the same like in uh, first person shooters when you control that uh, with the keyboard so this boat is departing from Yanikape shore. You can hear if this is a good timing somewhere during the noon. You can hear them screaming, uh, Bosphor, Bosphor, it means this trip. So you, you go there, land on the boat. It costs 100 liras, less than 4 euros. The trip is 2 hours long. Yeah, what you can buy right there on the square in front of this is chestnuts and maize both roasted both very untasty but in general you would have some some better better uh, snack with you on that boat trip besides if you have some bread you can feed the birds there is a halich uh, metro station on the bridge right next to Ataturk bridge you go to uh, to the right side so right next to that bridge there is an area which is called Yenikapu and from that Yenikapu you can take the boat so you can travel through Bosphorus and even listen to guidance on different languages it's not really working well because uh, the mixture of three languages and they are cut in a weird way so one is not finished and another one starts so you can't use that guidance uh, to learn something really new but sometimes you can understand what you are looking at from that guidance and it travels through Bosphorus. Uh, the trip takes about two hours. And during that two hours, you can see most interesting buildings from far away from the water. But depending on weather, it might be very interesting uh, to, because the, the birds are flying above. And it's a lot of fun to, to hear the sound of the birds and the... the, the the water some uh, boats are passing by so it's really a spectacular place see all those uh, important buildings which you can notice and then visit later plus you are accompanied by birds flying around and if you have some bread with you you can feed them I wouldn't recommend to swim in this water it's cold now, it's not summer, and even though I saw a bunch of people swimming in the water in December, uh, I actually saw five men swim away and then three men returned. I don't know what happened to the other two. Perhaps they swam to, to the boat somewhere in the middle of the Bosporus. But yeah, I, I never really wanted to swim in the winter, especially in, in the water like this, which I don't know. Maybe there are sharks in there. 
Who knows? As you can probably guess from my voice, I got cold. And I would probably better use the dictation and some voice generation tool, which I also gonna try. But I also have idea to make film how I treat myself when I get cold or get well I get actually get COVID I think because I can't smell I can't feel I, I lost sense of smell as well. So if there is a pile of poop around I'm not gonna smell it now. That's how bad it is. No smell at all. Now I appreciate a uh, sense of smell. So yeah, I'm gonna treat myself now. And if you are interested, I'm gonna put video there how I do that. I don't think anybody cares about that, but I have some life hacks. So I hope in a couple of days, I'm gonna be brand new, hopefully smelling again. I mean, sensing the smell. Mm -hmm.